so relevant for another in, in, in our society and, and mix them up together in a way that everybody could get what they wanted, you know? I, when I, and I know a lot of you did. Because you told me. There's, there's kids walking around named Billy. <laughs> but, um... When, when, when I wrote the song, I, mean, I knew that I knew that, that was, was going to have that effect, but it actually is not what you think it's about. Um, and I, wanna, I don't want to change the way you think about it. I mean, you, whatever you got with it, it's okay with me. Um, but no, I, I wrote it about the music business. It's more of a social commentary in the music business. But I knew that when I called it The Stroke, because I heard... I was, I was working with this, one of these guys at my record company and he was complaining, it's a little guy, and, and he said all the guys upstairs were stroking him to do stuff for him, you know. And I was like, that's a title. And I went, and if I call this song a stroke, I, 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 it's going to definitely get some attention, you know. So, so, I, so here we go. So I get all the attention, but I didn't have to sully my reputation by running, you know, one of those gutter songs, like those other bands were yeah, writing. You know, I, mean, I, could, I could rise above that and no still, still get all the action, but I had a, I had a cover for it, so it was, I mean, it was really great. Oh, wow. <laughs> really great. Did you ever hear that? Thing? I actually wrote another. I actually wrote another one of those, and it didn't work. Which is interesting. It shows you how things can be. Stroke part two. No, I, but I'm, I'm, I'm creatures. I'm, no, I'm creatures of habit. I wrote a song called "She Goes Down." And it was a, and it, no, but it was about theme, about strong women. If you listen to the lyrics, it was about strong women. But I said it's going to be like the Strokes. Everyone's going to think something else. But it that wasn't been worse. But it wasn't a hit. But it wasn't a hit. Maybe it was too. I went too far. But I thought this is going to, this is going to work because I got it. I can make a real because I'm very pro women. You know, and I can make a real good comment about women I, and get a lot of attention for it. But, you know, yeah, all the various channels that are open to. You. See that? <laughs> Well, you're right, though. It is about like, writing something that people can get whatever they get out of it. And always. Of it. Always. I mean, how many times have you, you know, you, you, you listen to a song, it's one of your favorite songs, and years later, you're, like, you're, you're singing along, and you find out the lyrics are better than what you're singing. <laughs> so, so the stroke was about I'm that. guilty. Oh, guilty. Uh, the stroke is about the music business. Basically. Yeah, I mean it could be about any, but it was yeah. Did you ever hear my experiences in the music business? Did you ever hear that thing that Hunter Thompson said about the music? Oh yes. Yeah. This is not. It might not be exact, but it's very close to this. The music business is a long plastic money trench. No, a long shallow money trench, a plastic hallway filled with liars, pimps, and thieves, but. There's also a, 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 a bad side. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I actually have that at home. I have so many reasons. I have a little. I have a little uh, that's also a bad side. That's the highest tips and fees, but it's also a bad side. <laughs> okay, moving right along. Do I hear a request for? Do I hear a request for pursuit of happiness? Well, we're gonna do pursuit of happiness. She got there first. So. This is from Happy Blue. This is from another one of my excursions into obscurity. Um, grasping for Oblivion, as it were, which is the title of one of the songs from that record. But that was something I wanted to do. I had never really played acoustic guitar, you know, kind of religiously. I never really got into it, so I wanted to do that. And I, I went out and looked naturally for inspiration from, the, from guitars. So I went, I went around to the shops and stuff and looked for guitars that inspired me by the way they sounded and made me think that I might write something in a different key or in the, in the key of that guitar. I could, I could hear the way the guitar works should, yeah. should sound. And, and then I would do tunings to it. So I was making up tunings, which of course I couldn't play it. You know, I just I just thought, well, I'll try this and I'll do this. And, and, and it was a real voyage of discovery. And I came up with some stuff that's some of the stuff that, um, you know, Really, really as proud of it as I could be, and this is one of them. Yeah. 